Vertical's halfback under is one of the best plays in Madden 24, and I'm going to show you how to run it as a quick snap setup where you only have to basically make one adjustment and you can snap the ball super fast. This is found in the Cincinnati Bengals offensive playbook, and all we're going to be doing with this play is streaking the running back. Now, really important in this year's Madden, if you do get press coverage on the outside, feel free to at least peek that solo receiver. If he does get that separation, then go ahead and throw the ball to him. This is going to force your opponent to have to do things like putting an outside third or just putting safety help in general over on that side. The next read on this play that we really want to look at is this crosser over the middle of the field. If that, that crosser is truly the best route on the field on the field for this play if they are in man-to-man -man coverage. So once we get them out of man coverage, they're going to probably go to some zone coverage. And so what we're going to do here is we're going to be able to utilize a seams concept on the right and on the left side. What you're going to notice here is if they jump to the tight end, oftentimes this crosser is going to be wide open. And essentially the read is really we're trying to create a seam where the user is going to have to choose somewhere in this middle of the field to play. So what you're going to see right here is he's going to choose to go guard the running back, which is going to leave this quick throw up the seam right in that little midpoint of the field. Verticals truly is a triangle read if you think about it, and it's really one of the best triangle reads we have in Madden every single year. Now, the next route on this play that we want to look to is once we look at these little seams, if we have some time and they're on a cover two, then we do want to look over here to do the vertical wheel. Now, right there, the safety or the corner actually played pretty decently. Uh, I got a kind of a random bump animation. But if you have time in the pocket, you'll be able to wait on this wheel route. And you're just going to freeform it to the sideline and attack the cover two just like that, as you can see. Super effective play for cover two because of what it can do to the sideline. One little pro tip is you can motion this guy out. When you motion him out on this wheel, one of the things that will do for you is it will just create a little bit easier of a throw for your quarterback deep down the sideline. Now, one of the best reasons to call verticals halfback under is if your opponent is wanting to run some what is known as double Mabel. That is when they are utilizing uh, basically zones like this to try to really take away the sidelines on either side. That's where this becomes one of the best plays in the game. You'll see here the user in this situation is going to choose to go guard the crosser. So we're just going to wait for this running back streak. We're going to throw it right up in the seam area just like that. Verticals halfback under is well equipped to be able to handle even things like match coverage as well. Because again, you have all of these seam reads and match coverage in general just never has handled crossers super well. And that crossing route is absolutely incredible. I want to go back to that double flat or double Mabel real quick. This also is true. Like, let's say, for example, you're playing somebody and they're sending five at you, right? And they, they play a send five like this. Let's say they try to go guard the running back quick out of the backfield. Well, if you think about this, it leaves this massive void where I can throw this quick throw right in that little window. Now, in that scenario, you saw the safety be able to come down and actually make a pretty decent play on the ball. So what I also want to show you here is if they are playing hard flats or whatever, then what you want to be able to also be able to uh, attack with this play is you want to look at your tight end. Oh, they don't have a yellow zone. Okay, I'm going to take my tight end quick. You see how this play really can break down a variety of different coverages and really force your opponent essentially into a coverage where maybe they're doing something. This is probably the best, the best uh, verticals defense right now because all you have to do is basically use the crosser in this example here, um, and I'll show it. So what you'll see here is they basically have to use the crosser. Other than that, sometimes this running back streak will get open up the seam, as you saw right there, if he has good route running and agility. Guys, this is just one of many examples as the reasons why verticals is as good of a play as it's been historically in Madden. And I actually have an entire ebook devoted to teaching how to run the gun bunch offset formation at a really, really high level. You can get access to that by joining the Patreon. I'm gonna put a link to that in the description of this video. But this, this play is really truly one of the best concepts we've ever seen at creating triangles in the middle of the field for you to be able to throw the ball consistently against any zone defense. Thanks for watching the video. And if you want to get the entire ebook on this offense, head down to the description and go click the link down below.